Hey guys, today we got a quick video about second shift and what it's like to work second shift. I wanna go through some of the things I like about it and then I'll talk about some of the, thing, the things that I don't like about it. Uh, first and foremost with second shift, I think the nicest thing about working that off shift is you're generally on a skeleton crew, meaning there's not as many people there. There's a little bit less supervision. There's usually a little bit less politics all of the higher, high or mid-level managers usually aren't there. You're usually on a smaller crew. It's a little bit less formal and you're gonna have more freedom and more responsibility to handle business when there's no one else really there to do it. Another thing I really like about second shift is you don't have to wake up super early in the morning. That being said, you're gonna still wanna get up early so you can go about your business and have a full productive day before you go into work because if you sleep in and then you only have a little bit of time before work and then get off work and go out to the bar or just hang out till real late you're pretty much going to sacrifice your whole day to work if you just have two or three hours in the morning then like two or three hours at night of free time it doesn't really feel like a real day so if you can be disciplined enough to get up, let's say seven or eight in the morning, you can wake up at like seven, get ready for your day, go out, do whatever you want throughout the whole day. And then from, you know, like 7 a.m. till 2 p.m., that's like seven hours. So you can really fit a whole lot into that seven hours. All right, so the last good thing about second shift, and they don't have this everywhere. Some places will have a shift differential. So you'll work second shift, maybe you'll make an extra one to three dollars extra you know, for that shift, get a little bit of extra money in your pocket. And again, being that there's usually less people there on second shift, you get to have more of a leadership role and have a little bit more responsibility and control over your schedule throughout the day. Those are the things I really like about second shift. The main thing for me is that there's a little bit more freedom and a little bit less supervision and a little bit more responsibility. Now let me go into the things that I really don't like about second shift. Um, the one thing, and this is a really big thing, is you're giving up your whole afternoon. Most of the time, second shift is from like 2 p.m. to 10.30 or something like that. So you're not really gonna be able to meet friends up for dinner or go to any weekday parties, and you're really sacrificing a, a big part of your day um, that, you know, that's when a lot of the social events happen. Again, unless you wanna get up or stay up really late and do social stuff after work. I never did that, because then you don't really have any free time, that's your free time. I don't think that's a good way to live. Um, another negative to working second shift is you don't really interact with, you know, the bosses as much. You're kind of off to the side on second shift. So you might not have a say in meetings and you might not have, you know, you don't have a lot of face time with the people that are running the company. So just keep that in mind. Um, you know, if your name comes up in a meeting, you're not really gonna get a chance to defend yourself as much. Uh, that's another con about working second shift. Um, so yeah, it's nice because you get to wake up early, but at the same time, you kind of sacrifice your day. Um, I don't know, that's all I can really think of right now. Uh, I hope you liked the video. Check out my channel, I have other videos about instrumentation and controls, automation, industrial maintenance, and uh, I'll catch you next time.